question from someone in our audience. So, Monica, what's your question? Well, my question has to do with uh, gray pubic hairs and fertility. Basically, I'm 32 years old. I don't have any kids. Um, I have gray pubic hairs, so I'm wondering if my fertility is at risk or if that's something that I don't have to worry about. Well, uh, answer right off the bat, it doesn't have to do anything with fertility, okay? And it just, it's all about aging. And, you know, a lot of us will get gray hair on our heads at different ages for a number of reasons. Usually, it's genetics. And so, depending on your genetics, you know, some people will get gray hair in their, their, sometimes their 20s or their 30s or their 40s. But typically, there's other things like nutritional deficiencies that can happen, other medical disorders that can cause um, premature graying. Uh, but there, again, there's things that you can do about it, and again, it helps it you feel is, good. Is, does it ever occur in isolation, gray there and not in your head? Did you also have gray early premature graying in your hair on your head as well? Both. Okay, so then that's mm -hmm. normal. Yeah, yeah, that's normal, that's okay. genetic, and, and you just, do you have any itching or any other problems? Because sometimes it's associated with skin disorders, like vitiligo. Yeah. No? Okay, so probably it's just, um, you know, a matter of aging. So you and don't have to wear it, and genes. genes. And so genetics. it doesn't have anything to do with fertility. So if you want to combat it, we have some tricks here for you with that. One, just like you can dye the hair on your head, you can dye your hair down there. And they call it, um, they call it the Betty, the Betty dye. And basically, they have all kinds of different dyes. And they actually have different stencils. You can like get a and Christmas tree and a star. In particular for down there? And it's just for down there. And then, you know, what a lot of us will, will do is just take it off, either with shaving, waxing. Um, Betty also makes a, a Betty Bear, which helps. Uh, it's a depilatory to remove hair. Waxing, whatever works for you. That's but a good idea. Laser or <laughs> uh, electrolysis or removing it all is one way that you don't have to worry about dying and don't have to be self-conscious. like that idea. But things that tell you about your fertility, usually your period, because it's usually related to your hormones, your period. So if you're having regular, are you having regular periods? Yes, regular. Yeah, as long as you're having regular periods, that's a good indicator that you're ovulating. That's more related to fertility than not. Okay? Thank you, though. Thanks so much, Monica.